hello guys and welcome to my channel today in this video guys i'm going to tell you how to install this buzzer module with led from iFlight onto this PDB F7 mini flight controller and then install it onto this Cinebo drone frame guys. In my previous videos guys, I've already done an in-depth review of this iFlight buzzer piece guys and this PDB F7 mini flight controller and this drone frame. If you have not seen those videos guys, I will put the link of the videos above or in the description below for you guys to check it out. So guys, if you're new to assembling drone, ensure that you watch this video till the end so that you do not miss out on any important information or instructions that I have to share. Before we move further guys, if if you're new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notifications for my new videos let's get started so guys before we can start installing this buzzer module with led onto the drone frame and connect it to the flight controller let me walk you through the process on how i'm going to connect all those components together so let's quickly open this buzzer module guys as you know this comes in a pair of two i have already installed one onto my previous drone build guys so this is the one that i have which i'm going to install it today so as you can see guys this is the buzzer module that it comes with and some of the wires that it comes along with so here on to the top you can see the centerpiece is your buzzer itself and on to the side guys these are your argb leds which are there combined with this module guys so what this argb led means is you can individually target each of these leds and control the color light and function of these led so which is why guys which is super important guys to connect it in the right way so that you can individually power this led and change the color and indicate different functions of your drone right from these leds guys so here onto the back side of the module guys here you can see there are few pins so here you have ground 5 volt led and buzzer minus and there is an out pin guys which we are not going to use so ground and 5 volt to power these module guys and then led signal to control the led and buzzer minus signal to turn on and turn off the buzzer module guys so that is how this buzzer module works and onto the flight controller guys here you can see this is a speedy mini f7 flight controller here you have buzzer plus and buzzer minus to control the buzzer and 5 volt ground and led to connect the led module if you have it separately since we have it all combined guys so buzzer plus is nothing more than your 5 volt and then you have the ground so that is how i'm going to power this module and then you have led signal and buzzer minus signal to control the led and buzzer minus to control the buzzer so that is how guys i'm going to connect this buzzer module onto the flight controller in addition to that guys i will be installing this buzzer module onto the bottom side of the drone frame guys so that i have leds visible from the bottom whenever i am flying the drone high up in the sky guys that is why guys i'm going to install this buzzer module onto the bottom side here you can see guys i have installed few plastic standoff guys right onto the drone frame by the help of the screws guys it is there onto the bottom onto the top of it guys I'm going to install this buzzer module like this so that my buzzer is at the bottom at the same time it is visible from the bottom whenever I am flying the drone so that I have the right indicator present onto the drone frame visible. Here you can see guys there is some space onto the bottom side frame of the drone guys so that is where guys I'm going to put the cable and then as you know guys my flight controller is going to sit at the back side of the drone frame guys so I will be installing the wires long enough so that it can move all the way from the back towards this hole and then connect it to the buzzer module which is present here guys as you can see guys the wires that it comes along with is too thick for this drone frame guys since this is a really small cinebook drone frame guys so i would need a thinner wire guys to connect it so i have chosen these wires that i have purchased separately to connect my buzzer module so here i have got four color wire guys here you have green and red for power and ground and then purple for led and brown for your buzzer minus guys so that is how guys i'm going to install it so this is the wire that i'm going to use so this is the high level overview guys on how i'm going to connect it to my drone frame and to the flight controller guys now let's quickly solder the components and assemble it onto the drone frame 
So guys, as you can see, I have already tinned the ports. So here you have ground and then LED and onto the front you have buzzer plus and buzzer minus. So that is how guys I'm going to install. So here you can see guys, I have coated this wire into the shrinkable cover so as to be able to have a better cable management guys. At the same time guys, I have already got all the wires guys here punched together. So I will solder them one by one let's quickly do that so first one is your led and ground so your purple is your led so let's quickly solder the led so here you can see guys my led wires is connected let's quickly connect the ground which is your green So here you can see guys, my ground is connected as well. So guys, now let's quickly connect buzzer minus and buzzer plus. So buzzer minus is your brown wire guys. Let's quickly connect the brown wire first. So my brown wire is connected. Now let's connect the red wire, which is my buzzer plus. So as you can see guys, my all four wires are connected. Now let's connect the other end to the buzzer. So guys, before we can start soldering the other side of the wires onto the buzzer guys, we need to pass it through the hole guys, so that whenever we install, we do not have problem of cable management and it stays neat. So let's do this like this. And then guys, we can install the buzzer. This is long enough wire guys. After soldering, we can move it back so as to be able to install and align the flight controller onto the drone frame. And at the same time, your wires will be connected onto the buzzer module. So let's quickly solder the wire guys. So first thing first, let's quickly tin the ports. So this is your ground. This is your ground and then next is your 5 volt and then your LED and then your buzzer. So as you can see guys all my ports are now tint. Let's quickly connect the wires. So let's start with ground which is your green wire connect the green wire first so my ground is connected and then you have 5 volt which is your red wire so my red wire is connected as well and then you have purple for LED And the last one is your brown wire, which is for your buzzer minus. So as you can see guys, all my four wires are now connected. Let's quickly install it onto the frame and we will again move it back the wires. So guys, as you can see, all four wires are now connected. Now let's quickly install it onto the frame. Here you have the standoffs and these are the M.2 screws that I have that will be used to hold this buzzer module onto its place. Now let's quickly put the wires inside and twist it to align it like this. Give it some slack guys so that your wires are not tight enough and you will be able to move things easily. So let's put the screws and then using the screwdriver guys you can tighten it up so one side is done let's do the same thing for the other side like this So here you can see guys, all my four wires are connected 
and my LED and my buzzer module in installed onto the cover of the drone frame guys here you can see I have a place for cable management that will be used as a cable alley whenever I install the frame like this so let's put this onto the drone frame so here is the drone frame guys here is my flight controller guys that is going to be installed onto the back side of the drone frame guys and this cover is going to be closed onto this like this so that is how guys i'm going to close the drone frame as there are a lot of other components guys which i still have to install guys so i'm not going to close it in this video guys so ensure that guys you stay tuned to my channel so that you do not miss out on those videos in my future videos guys i will also tell you how to configure the leds how to configure the buzzer guys in the firmware of the flight controller so this is it guys this concludes this video on how to install the buzzer with LED module and connect it on to your flight controller. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys like this video, please do not forget to hit that like button. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. I will try and answer as soon as possible. If you are new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notifications for all my new videos. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching and clear skies.